guys, so guys, I thought I would start off with the simpler things that you that I can kind of explain off for you. So this is my eyelash curler. It is by Clean Color. It is pink. I don't really use it as often as I used to. So yeah, just disregard this. Um, this is a Mac. Studio Fix Fluid, I believe is what it's called. And I don't really use that much either. Then we have ELF. We have an ELF cream liner. Oops. An ELF cream liner. And it is in this brown color that I think is so beautiful. Then we have... Whoops. And then we have this eyeliner. I don't know who it's by because I, it's so old. But yeah, it's just a regular eyeliner. And then we're going to move on to mascara. Then all these are mascaras. Um, again, I don't know who this is. Oh, wait. This is by Maybelline. This is by Maybelline. This is their brow drama. I don't know if you can really see it. I don't know if my camera will fixate on it. But yeah, this is the Maybelline brow drama. And this is a the this is the CoverGirl, I believe, Lash Blast. Yeah, this is their Flamed Out. Then this is one that I don't know. Again, I don't know. Um, oh, it's by Revlon. And then we have my go-to favorites, which are my Maybelline Falsies, the Falsies Volume Express, which you've seen in other videos. And then this is another random eyeliner that's just sitting around. As far as foundation is concerned, I only have two because these most most of the time I throw mine away. But this one I'm no longer using. I just finished the whole bottle. It is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless, but I have replaced it with the Dewy and Smooth one just because I like to change it up. I feel like I've been wearing matte makeup for a very long time, and I don't really like how it looks just because that very dry thing is not really good for covering up acne or things of that nature. So I'm just gonna go with Dewy and Smooth for a while. Moving along, this is the only highlighter that I currently use, and this is my e.l.f. Golden Bronzer. If you want to see what it looks like on the inside, I can show you. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's a bit ratchet right now, <laughs> but yeah, I pretty much love this, these two top ones. Not the pink and the brown, but the ones that you can see that are kind of used up. Yeah, I've used them a lot, but it's a pretty good bronzer. I mean, it could be a lot better, but for its price, which was like a dollar, it's pretty good. Then this is the NYX Illuminator. I have yet to really use it. But this is what it looks like. It is this pretty shimmery color. Which, you know, I think I could use that as my highlighter. So, yeah. Then, um, I will show you guys my powders. This is my Fit Me Maybelline Setting Powder um, in Coconut 335. But I think that this one is actually for... Um, this is actually for the, the dewy one and not the matte one. But, whatever. I also have the same thing in... I have the same setting setting um, powder. Well, no, this is the foundation one in matte and poreless. It is three three third. It's three three hundred and thirty Tofi, which is a powder. And honestly, I just use it as a highlight. I just use it to like as a concealer for my brows. If we're gonna be honest. And this is my setting powder by Zuri that I use when I am um, doing when I'm actually baking. And it is a translucent powder, which I prefer when it comes to that. It does a pretty okay job. Then over here we have my brushes and my e.l.f. Well, we have my beauty blender, my e.l.f. Um, sharpener. Then I have a brush right here that I use mainly for just a good contour. And then we have all my makeup brushes and my brow pencils. Anything that does with deals with the brows, um, eyeliner, like pencil eyeliners, anything that's in a pencil form pretty much goes in here along with my brushes. So as you can see, these are pencils, um, eyebrow pencils, um, eyeliners, things of that nature. Then we have my Naked 2 palette by Urban Decay. We have this big, big, big palette that I bought from Nick and K that's kind of ratchet. Then we have my e.l.f. Um, eyelid primer, which I just recently bought along with my um, Maybelline um, foundation. I, I have these little itty bitty um, palettes. Well, not palettes, but these itty bitty like eyeshadow things. I, don't, I forget what they're called. Um, but they're the individual ones, and they're all by e.l.f. But I, I think you can use them as a highlighter. Oh. 
I think you could use them as a blush or a highlighter if you really wanted to just because of the, the colors and the way it's not too shimmery. Then I have this palette that was given to me that I don't really use. Then I have another one by Nikki K. I actually have three. All three of these are by Nikki K. These are different colors. Um, out of all, out of everything, out of all the palettes on here, I think I've had this one the longest, I think. So, yeah. And then finally, my favorite part, which is the lipsticks. Um, the only lipsticks that I've had for a very long time are all three of these. And this one right here. And this one. But the rest of these are fairly new. All of the, this whole row are just new lips. These, all of these, this whole little part is just new. And then these are semi-new. And then this one is new, new, old, old. But yeah, I don't really know if this is the way you're supposed to do a collection video, but this is the best way I knew how to do it. I thought you wanted me to explain, you know, how I have all this makeup. Um, the, it's definitely growing, so yeah, my nail polish collection is even bigger. So, until next time, guys, Mo is out.